Hey guys, welcome to this week's Drummer Challenge Wednesday at Spirit and Groove, spiritandgroove.com. So this week we're going to do a little bit of work on syncopation. And to do that, we're going to need a few pieces of material. Obviously, you're going to need some sticks, you're going to need a metronome, you're going to need something to hit, drum set, practice pad, anything like that will work for you. And you're also going to need one of the most important pieces of practice material for drummers, Ted Reed's Syncopation. So if you don't have this book, I encourage you to, to go buy it. You can actually buy it right from our website. Um, I will put the link on this blog post. We're an affiliated Amazon partner, so you can just order directly through us. Uh, once you have Ted Reed's Syncopation, I'm going to have you open up to exercise six. In my book, it's on page 42, but my book's a little bit older. I've had it for mm, probably about 10 years now. So. Once you have exercise six opened up, here's the challenge. Actually, let me grab this again to show you what's going on. You're going to set your metronome. In this case, we are set at 108. And what you're going to do is you're going to start at the top. And you're going to go all the way to the end. Now, here comes the challenge. If you make a mistake anywhere along this roadmap, you have to finish the full iteration and start over again. And you have to keep on doing that until you go through an entire pass without making a mistake. It's really going to challenge your focus, your ability to uh, finish a song and to really just, well, focus. I guess I'll say it again the second time because that's really what this is all about. It's about focus. Focus more than syncopation. So again, you start at the top, you go all the way through, you make a mistake, say here, ah, you don't stop and start over. You gotta finish that iteration and do it again and keep on doing it and keep on doing it and keep on doing it. So as always, please uh, tag us in your videos of you trying this out. Uh, we would love to see you working on some of these Drummer Challenge Wednesdays. If you have your own challenges, please shoot us an email. Let us know your thoughts. We'd like to hear you know, some of the challenges you'd like to see happen in Drum Challenge Wednesday. So here we go. I'm going to give it a shot. Uh, wish me luck. So it looks like the stars aligned on that iteration for me and I actually burned through it and uh, didn't make a mistake. So woohoo! Um, what I would suggest at this point is maybe going to another challenge or you can change it up and you can try doing this with your feet. Uh, you can try doing it while you're holding a, a, a swing pattern and trying to hit these marks. Uh, the challenge is really up to you, um, but I really think that you know the first time you do exercise six and try to do this, uh, it's going to be that much of a challenge for you. So until next week, that's this week's Drummer Challenge Wednesday here at spiritandgroove.com. I encourage you to come back, visit with us, get involved with our drum community, tag us in your videos at Spirit and Groove on Instagram. Uh, maybe go buy yourself a groovy hat, maybe buy yourself a groovy t-shirt. But above all else, just get out, get groovy, get drumming. Till next week.